Good evening, South Jersey. I'm meteorologist Joe Martucci. This is the month of January, and we see a lot of browns here between Monday through Friday. But as we have gone through our weekends, we have seen rain in each of them. We saw rain on the 4th, rain on the 12th, rain on the 18th, and we will be seeing rain on the 25th. Now, as we go into next week, we should have a reboot performance of this past week, dry during the work week, and then a storm looks likely for some time for our first weekend of February. If this were the summer, I think we'd have something not so nice to say about how the month has gone weather-wise. However, being it is January, I believe we have been mostly okay with it. Let's track this rain for you on Saturday, 4 a.m. Mostly dry here. Rain just starts to enter in some portions of Salem and Cumberland County at that time. By 7 a.m., it is pretty much everywhere. And it is a soaking rain as we go throughout the morning hours. Areas of roadway flooding will be likely just from the rain alone. And we'll have a strong southeasterly wind, too. So that garbage can might topple over. Maybe get a couple of down trees branches but overall nothing extreme with the winds but by 1 p.m. on Saturday that rain is moving on out of here it ends between 12 to 3 p.m. and in terms of rainfall totals looks to be a bump up from previous forecast 1.4 inches in Stoke Creek 1.3 inches in Hamilton the general gist between three quarters of an inch mainly along the shore up to an inch and a half for places well inland and didn't mention this but there is a potential that we do see a thunderstorm during our Saturday morning as well now for the shore areas we will be talking about coastal flooding our first coastal flooding event since december 31st so we've got a long period of time thankfully without the coastal flooding but we are in minor flood stage in atlantic city for the saturday morning high tide and in cape may very close to moderate flood stage moderate flood stage is when you start to see water inundate homes and businesses minor flood stage is more of our nuisance flood stage the typical roadways are flooding move your car a block or two if you need to and if you see flooded water do not drive through it for this evening temperatures falling through to 30s here we have a cloudy sky calm winds and that'll be pretty much the case for the overnight hours low temperature of 30 over in Mullica and the mainland 34 over in Margate and the shore and if you do need a warm place to sleep there are code blue alerts in effect for Atlantic and Cape May counties that will be in effect uh, through Friday night for Atlanta County and just for tonight here in Cape May County. For Friday, thickening clouds. And as we go throughout the day, it's not going to look the nicest, but it will be a comfortable day for any outdoor activities or work. Here's your mainland seven day forecast. Saturday, rain mainly in the morning. Sunday, mostly cloudy behind it. But as we go into next week, another quiet one here. Temperatures in the 40s at or just above seasonal levels with a good amount of sunshine. For the latest in South Jersey weather, you can find us on social media. Facebook and Instagram at JoeMarkWX, Twitter at AC Press Martucci, or you can go to our website at thepressofac.com/slash weather.